The idea of taking out a loan to invest can be both enticing and terrifying. Sure, there's the potential for huge gains, but also the risk of significant losses. So, is this a gamble you're willing to take? Welcome, my name is John, and in this video, we're going to dive deep into the controversial topic of borrowing to invest. We'll explore the risks and rewards of leveraging your investments, the different types of loans you can use, and most importantly, whether this strategy is the right move for you. Stay tuned until the end, as we'll provide you with crucial insights and considerations to help you make an informed decision that aligns with your financial goals. Let's kick things off by discussing the pros and cons of borrowing to invest. This strategy can be a double-edged sword, offering the potential for higher returns, but also exposing you to increased risks. One of the primary advantages of borrowing to invest is the ability to access additional capital beyond your existing funds. By leveraging borrowed funds, you can increase the size of your investment portfolio and take advantage of opportunities that may have been out of reach with your own resources alone. What's more, with a larger investment capital at your disposal, you have the potential to realize higher returns on your investments. By strategically allocating borrowed funds into well-performing assets, you can amplify your gains and accelerate your wealth-building journey. Borrowing to invest also allows you to diversify your investment portfolio across a broader range of assets or securities. Diversification can help spread risk and mitigate potential losses by not putting all your eggs in one basket. By diversifying your investments, you can enhance the stability and resilience of your portfolio. Taking out a loan to invest provides you with the flexibility to seize time-sensitive investment opportunities or respond to market trends swiftly. Additionally, you can maintain liquidity in your existing assets while leveraging borrowed funds for new investments, allowing you to optimize your overall investment strategy. In some cases, the interest paid on investment loans may be tax deductible, providing potential tax benefits for investors. By leveraging tax advantages, you can optimize your investment returns and reduce your overall tax liability. Finally, by strategically using borrowed funds to invest in income-generating assets or appreciating investments, you can accelerate the accumulation of wealth over time. This can help you achieve your financial goals faster and build a more robust investment portfolio. As enticing as the advantages may be, taking out a loan to invest also comes with significant risks that investors must carefully consider. Perhaps the most significant risk of borrowing to invest is the potential for magnified losses. If your investments underperform or the market experiences a downturn, you are still obligated to repay the loan amount along with interest, even if the value of your investments has decreased. This can lead to substantial financial losses that exceed your initial investment. Borrowing to invest also incurs interest costs that can eat into your investment returns. If the returns on your investments do not surpass the cost of the loan, including interest and fees, you may end up in a worse financial position. High interest rates or variable interest rates can further increase the cost of borrowing, impacting the profitability of your investment strategy. Furthermore, investing borrowed funds exposes you to the inherent volatility of the financial markets. Market fluctuations can impact the value of your investments and the ability to repay the loan. Sudden market downturns or unexpected events can lead to significant losses and financial stress for investors who have borrowed to invest. Meanwhile, taking out a loan to invest increases your debt burden and financial obligations. If you are unable to meet the loan repayment schedule or face difficulties in repaying the borrowed funds, it can lead to financial strain, damage to your credit score, and potential legal consequences. Managing debt levels and ensuring timely repayment is crucial to avoid adverse outcomes. If you have borrowed to invest using a margin loan, you may face margin calls from your broker if the value of your investment portfolio falls below a certain threshold. Failing to meet margin calls can result in the forced liquidation of assets in your portfolio to cover losses, potentially leading to further financial setbacks. On top of this, borrowing to invest can impact your credit risk profile, especially if you struggle to repay the loan as agreed. Defaulting on a loan can damage your credit score and make it challenging to access credit in the future. It is essential to assess your ability to manage debt responsibly before taking out a loan to invest. 
If you're thinking of borrowing to invest, it's essential to understand the various types of loans available for investment purposes. Each type of loan comes with its own features, terms, and considerations that can impact your investment strategy. For starters, personal loans are unsecured loans that can be used for various purposes, including investing. These loans typically have fixed interest rates and repayment terms. Personal loans may be suitable for smaller investment amounts, but often come with higher interest rates compared to secured loans. On the other hand, home equity loans and home equity lines of credit allow homeowners to borrow against the equity in their homes. These loans typically have lower interest rates than personal loans because they are secured by the property. Home equity loans can provide a source of funds for larger investments, but come with the risk of potentially losing your home if you default on the loan. Meanwhile, margin loans are offered by brokerage firms and allow investors to borrow funds to purchase securities. These loans are secured by the investor's investment portfolio and can be used to leverage investments in the stock market. Margin loans come with risks, including margin calls and potential liquidation of assets if the value of the portfolio declines. If you are looking to invest in real estate, investment property loans can provide financing for purchasing rental properties or other real estate investments. These loans are secured by the property being purchased and may have different terms and requirements than traditional mortgages. For entrepreneurs looking to invest in their businesses or new ventures, business loans can provide the necessary capital. These loans can be used for purchasing equipment, expanding operations, or funding growth initiatives. Business loans come in various forms, including term loans, lines of credit, and small business administration loans. Before choosing a loan for investment purposes, it's important to carefully evaluate the terms, interest rates, repayment schedules, and risks associated with each type of loan. Consider consulting with a financial advisor to determine the most suitable loan option based on your investment goals and financial situation. If you're thinking of taking out a loan for investment purposes, it's crucial to evaluate several key factors that can impact the success of your investment strategy. For starters, you should clearly define your investment objectives and goals before taking out a loan for investment. Determine whether you are seeking capital growth, income generation, portfolio diversification, or other specific outcomes. Then, align your borrowing and investment strategy with your investment objectives to ensure coherence and focus. Also, be sure to assess your risk tolerance and comfort level with financial risk before borrowing to invest. Take the time to learn about the potential risks involved in leveraging borrowed funds for investments and evaluate whether you are prepared to accept the possibility of losses. You should also consider your risk tolerance in relation to the volatility of the investments and the potential impact on your financial well-being. It's also important to evaluate your current financial stability, including income, expenses, assets, and liabilities, before considering borrowing for investment. Ensure that you have a solid financial foundation and sufficient cash flow to meet loan repayments and cover unexpected expenses. You should always avoid borrowing beyond your means or jeopardizing your financial stability for the sake of investment. Be sure to carefully review the terms and conditions of the loan, including interest rates, repayment schedule, fees, and any potential penalties. It always helps to compare different loan options to find the most favorable terms that align with your investment strategy. Try to calculate the total cost of borrowing and assess whether the potential returns on your investments justify the expenses. Make sure to conduct thorough research on potential investment opportunities before borrowing to invest. Evaluate the performance history, risks, and growth potential of the investments you are considering. Also, consider performing a cash flow analysis to assess your ability to meet loan repayments and manage your investment portfolio effectively. Think about the impact of loan repayments on your cash flow and budget accordingly. Ensure that you have a contingency plan in place to cover unexpected expenses or fluctuations in investment returns. Finally, develop a clear exit strategy for your investments in case market conditions change or your investment objectives evolve. Determine the conditions under which you will sell or hold investments and adjust your strategy accordingly. Having a well-defined exit strategy can help you manage risks and make informed decisions about your investments. By considering these factors before borrowing to invest, you can make informed decisions that align with your financial goals, risk tolerance, and investment strategy.
Conduct thorough due diligence, seek professional advice, and carefully assess the potential risks and rewards of borrowing for investment purposes to enhance your chances of financial success. While taking out a loan for investment purposes can offer potential benefits, there are circumstances where it may be advisable to avoid borrowing to invest. Understanding when to refrain from leveraging borrowed funds for investment is crucial to safeguarding your financial well-being. For instance, if you already have high levels of existing debt, taking on additional debt for investment purposes can further strain your financial situation. High debt levels can increase your financial risk, limit your ability to repay the loan, and potentially lead to financial distress if the investments do not perform as expected. Prioritize reducing existing debt before considering borrowing for investment. If your income is unstable or uncertain, taking out a loan for investment can pose significant risks. Fluctuations in income may impact your ability to meet loan repayment obligations, especially if your investments do not generate the expected returns. As such, you should avoid borrowing to invest if you do not have a stable source of income to support loan repayments. Also, if you have short-term financial goals or liquidity needs, borrowing to invest may not align with your objectives. Investments carry inherent risks and may not provide immediate returns or liquidity when needed. If you have short-term financial obligations that require immediate funds, this is not a good investment strategy for you. Investing borrowed funds without a solid understanding of investment principles and strategies can be risky. A lack of investment knowledge may lead to poor investment decisions, increasing the likelihood of losses and the inability to repay the loan. To put it bluntly, this is not a good move for you if you are not well-versed in investment practices or lack the necessary expertise. Keep in mind that investing borrowed funds in high-risk or speculative assets can amplify the potential for losses. If you are considering high-risk investments that are volatile or speculative in nature, borrowing to invest may expose you to excessive risk. Avoid taking out a loan for investments that are highly speculative and may result in substantial losses. Remember, borrowing to invest requires a higher risk tolerance due to the potential for magnified losses. If you are risk-averse or uncomfortable with the idea of shouldering additional financial risk, it may be best to avoid taking out a loan for investment. Be honest with yourself when you are assessing your risk tolerance, and only consider borrowing for investment if you are prepared to accept the associated risks. Now that we've gone through the various risks and potential pitfalls to avoid, let's take a look at ways to manage these risks so that you can safeguard your financial well-being and maximize the potential benefits of borrowing to invest. First, Conduct a comprehensive risk assessment before taking out an investment loan. Evaluate the potential risks associated with borrowing to invest, including market volatility, interest rate fluctuations, investment performance, and loan repayment obligations. Identify and understand the risks involved to make informed decisions about borrowing for investment purposes. It may also help to diversify your investment portfolio to spread risk and reduce the impact of potential losses. Allocate borrowed funds across different asset classes, industries, and investment opportunities to minimize concentration risk. This can help protect your investments from market downturns and enhance the overall stability of your portfolio. In addition to this, perform stress tests on your investment portfolio to assess how it would perform under adverse market conditions. Consider scenarios such as market downturns, interest rate hikes, and economic recessions to evaluate the resilience of your investments. Stress testing can help you identify potential vulnerabilities and adjust your investment strategy accordingly. Also, develop a comprehensive loan repayment plan to ensure that you can meet your loan obligations effectively. Calculate the total cost of borrowing, including interest payments and fees, and budget for loan repayments in your financial plan. Afterwards, establish a repayment schedule that aligns with your cash flow and investment returns to avoid financial strain. Be sure to regularly monitor the performance of your investments and review your loan obligations to track progress and identify any potential issues. Stay informed about market developments, economic trends, and changes in interest rates that may impact your investments. Be sure to conduct periodic reviews of your investment portfolio and loan terms to make adjustments as needed. If things do go sour, 
It will help to have contingency plans to address unexpected events or changes in market conditions that may impact your investments or loan repayments. Establish emergency funds or backup sources of liquidity to cover unforeseen expenses or financial setbacks. Having these backup plans in place can help you navigate challenging situations and protect your financial stability. Lastly, do not hesitate to seek advice from financial professionals, such as financial advisors, investment experts, or loan specialists to guide your investment decisions and risk management strategies. Consult with professionals who can provide insights, expertise, and recommendations tailored to your individual financial circumstances and investment goals. By proactively managing the risks of investment loans through risk assessment, diversification, stress testing, loan repayment planning, monitoring, contingency planning, and seeking professional advice, you can enhance the resilience of your investment strategy and optimize the potential returns. Of borrowing to invest, these risk management practices will allow you to mitigate potential downsides and position yourself for long-term financial success. As we wrap up our discussion on borrowing to invest, I want to hear from you. What do you think about this investment strategy? Are you willing to take on the risks for the potential rewards? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. For more free and practical information on investing in personal finance, check out the link in the video description. If you found this video informative and helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content on managing your money wisely. Thank you for watching. And remember, informed decisions lead to financial success. See you in the next video.